it going? I've had a haircut. Do I look like a beetle? Perhaps. Sexier than a beetle. So we're just cruising. I might not be able to hear me for the wind. It's really windy today. But we're just having a wee scout about to see if there's anything happening. Um, I've got some books. So we'll go and look at those. Um, I also got a sweet birthday present for my brother. Uh, so we'll show that off to you. So let's go see what's going on. Check it out guys, got the Nintendo. Um, my brother gave me this as a birthday present. I got some games with it and I've got some games of my own already. Um, Ocarina of Time was one my brother gave me. I just want to keep an eye on it because this gets quite bright in a second. It might bleed out the camera. But uh, Jet Force Gemini, this was one I picked up recently. Uh, see if we can get that. that. Awesome. Yeah. Pokemon Stadium. So I've got the transfer pack for Pokemon Stadium coming, so I'm going to be able to play. I thought you could play any any Game Boy game, you can't. You can only play the Gen 1 Pokemon games, which is fine for now. Um, that's probably what I would have been playing on the telly anyway. Uh, the Star Wars Episode 1 Racer. Banjo-Kazooie. GoldenEye, I think there's actually two GoldenEyes. GoldenEyes. Uh, WWF No Mercy, I don't know how I feel about that, I don't know if that'll be getting a shot. Fighter's Destiny, I don't actually know what that is, I guess it's like a Tekken style game. Lilith Wars, very, very happy to have that, I've already, I was playing this last night. Uh, World Cup 98, me and my brothers used to play this game all the time for the PlayStation, so I was actually really happy with this, <laughs> randomly. And... Rogue Squadron, Star Wars. So I'm gonna be getting, I'm gonna be getting more. I'm bidding on a Pokemon Snap right now, but the most important thing for me just now is the transfer pack. But um, yeah, got the N64. Anybody uh, actually leave comments in the comment section for Nintendo 64 games I should be looking at. I think I want to get Doom 64. Davis recommended that to me and Rig recommended one, and I've forgotten it already. I think it was maybe Pokemon Snap, anyway. Um, yeah, please, if, you, if there's any good games I'm, you think I'm missing, chuck them in the comments section. Get in. So there wasn't really anything happening. I did get this though. Northern Star by Mel C, the Spice Girl. There was one very specific reason I got it. And it was this, hang on, I'm trying to open it here. I don't know how well this is going to come out on camera. Pretty sure I was very delighted with that picture when I was younger. Um, yeah, one pound? That was worth a pound. Okay, so I'm away to film the uh, bit for the, for film my comic books. But I fancy a beer, and it's Christmas, so I'm gonna go and bloody get one. They've got these like grapefruit wheat beers in the shop just up here, so I'm gonna go and get one of those. They're only 3% or 2% or something, but they're tasty and they usually have them in the fridge, so fingers crossed, guys. 
Otherwise, I'm just going to have to get anything out of the fridge because I'm not drinking warm beer. I'm not an animal. I don't have it. Sweet. Right. Let's do some comic books. First off is the uh, the Art Germ Supergirl number 16. That light is shocking. Let's just move this back a bit. I apologize, I've got a microphone hanging from there. That's probably sounding rank right now. Okay, is that any better? You can see the attic. Let's open the attic. There we go. We'll see if anything peeks out while we're doing this. Uh, I just want to show this again. Just in case it wasn't very obvious what I was showing. <laughs> That's a bit better that time, isn't it? Mendoza will probably have to do a risk and a non-risk on that cover. Right, yeah. Anyway, stop dicking about. Metal, just this morning that came through the door. So I'm pleased to get that. I try and buy... If I buy my books online as an order, they'll ship when the last book gets here. So if I... Tr I try and buy ones that I really want separately so that they come. But if... Yeah, so if I buy the order, if I buy over five books, I get like 20% discount. So sometimes I just bite the bullet and stick everything in. So I get, you know, a couple of those books free. Anyway, this was planning to be my next... Uh, series once I'd finished Adventure Comics, the Supergirl bit. It's um I can't even remember his name. Uh Detective Comics run. Um what's his name? I wanna say it's Steve. But it's not, is it? Engelhart. I was close. Steve Engelhart. The Detective Comics run um, it's got so many iconic issues. Every every issue is basically a first appearance of somebody, except for this, which is an iconic issue. It's got the Batman Joker cover, uh, first appearance of Dr. Phosphorus, first appearance of Silver St. Cloud, first appearance first Silver of Death, Deadshot, Deathstroke, one of the two. Anyway, Detective Comics number 472, and this is actually quite near the end of that Engelhart run. Here's another Supergirl, uh, number 390 this one is, the all romance issue. I'm not really sure what they were doing around this time, because a lot of those gothic books started coming out, the Dark Mansion and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, this is kind of like a tie into that I guess. After watching that Animal Man documentary I spoke about last week, I got uh, number 25 and 26 of... Animal Man. Not Animal Man documentary. Grant Morrison documentary. I got 25 and 26. Um, I wanted the end of it because Grant Morrison actually writes himself into these issues. I don't know if you've read... If you haven't read Grant Morrison's Animal Man, Animal Man check it out. It's amazing. There he is there. He's actually discussing Animal Man's kind of life with him as they're walking around Glasgow. So it's really cool. Or a comic book Glasgow kind of interpretation. Um, yeah, and Klaus, the Christmas special. I can't remember if I had this last week or if I got this this week. But yeah, this was actually quite good. Um, I sometimes think that... I don't understand why Morrison does books like that. But it was really good, so... I can't really knock it. Um, I watched the Happy TV show today. This morning I watched the first episode, that was awesome. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing the rest of that. Uh, finally, I got Amazing Spider-Man 32. So I need 30 and 35. 
to have that whole s- stretch from 30 to 39. And then we'll start going lower, see how far we can get. I want to start picking up, I probably said this last week as well, I want to start picking up like random issues. I don't necessarily need them all, but I would like um, 42 and then as many Ditko ones as I can get. There's actually an issue 10 online just now that's not terrible price, but the guy's had it in a frame. Like He's selling it as a piece of art as opposed to a comic and it's completely bleached. It's wrecked. So, I mean, it's worth probably 10 bucks, but he wants a lot more than that. So we'll see what happens there, but I, re- I don't know. I'd only pay 10 bucks for it. I wouldn't pay more. Um, I got an early birthday, early Christmas present from my wife. So stoked with this. It's unreal. This is uh, the Skyrim Atmospheres. Look at that. So cool. Uh, Record Store Day exclusive. And the the vinyl itself. I, I don't actually know why they do this. Because it's not fitting Elder Scrolls at all. This like weird... Snowy... I don't know what it is. I don't know what they describe that as. Still. Really fancy. I guess it makes it more desirable. But yeah, this is like the next best thing from that. F- they've got a four disc uh, soundtrack. But that's things like 120 bucks. Anyway, that's the this that's the Skyrim. So um, yeah, that's everything this week, guys. I forgot to say that I um, I got the drum kit. Okay, guys, that's uh, that's us this week. Um, next week, I'm gonna during the week sometime. I'm gonna do another cover of the year video. So look out your favorite cover and we'll get a playlist going again um if you don't if you never caught the videos last year go check the yeah i think it's just cover of the year in my playlist Uh, should be cover of the year 2016 go check that out and um everybody have a very merry christmas on monday and yeah we'll see you during the week wednesday probably i'll wait until the last wednesday before i upload the video so you can use a book from then if uh if that's your favorite of the year anyway Take it easy, guys, and we'll see you next week. Cheers.